Hi friends, welcome back to playing tribute to Fire Emblem Awakening, where I have officially decided that I think I'm going to uh, bond Muriel and Frederick because Muriel, I was looking back on old conversations and Muriel was the one to say that she wanted to become friends with Frederick. She's like, oh, I want to experience this bond and blah, blah, blah. So you know what? I'm going to do it. It's just going to happen. Muriel and Frederick will be bonded together. However, I'm going to save that for the interlude because I don't like to do the bonding conversations during the main stories or paralogues uh, because that's its own thing. So, we are going to jump in here. Uh, we do not need to use Muriel anymore for bonds. Uh, I am going to continue bonding Vake and Cordelia to see how they go. Um, I might go back to Maribel with him, though. Uh, I also have to remember that Lon Q is available, uh, who's also currently bonding with Maribel, so I guess they're going to vie for her and what she's going to do. Libra and Tharja are done. That's what we're, that's the kid we're looking at right now. Uh, Gaius and Lissa are the two that we are currently on, uh, bonding with, and Chersha and Henry are bonding. I've got a whole, like, I've got a list over here. It's actually not so much a list as a bunch of scribbles at this point now because of all the changes and check marks and stars that I've written on it, but, uh, and question marks. Uh, but yeah, let's jump in to the Kidnapper's Keep and see, uh, if we can meet Tharja's child. Um, I never saved it, so let me make sure that I do that, and then... A shot from the dark. A shot from the dark. <laughs> All alone are you, lamb, off searching for dear old mum. How very sweet. But the world's a dangerous place, my dear, full of wolves waiting to snatch you up. Um, so thank you for the warning, sir, but... but... <laughs> That's no warning, lamb. I'm a wolf and you've been snatched. Now come quietly. Scars tend to know what to say. And we won't want that. My lord. Slaver's blood. What? We'll have to hurry if we hope to catch them. Let's <laughs> stay right here and just let me go to work. The curse to wither them away, perhaps. The slow death over a year. Oh, fine. Let's move it too. <sighs> I think their captive would likely appreciate something a bit more immediate. Shepard, saving the girls is our top priority. Now move out. Hurry over to her. Do I need my flyers? It's a good thing I have flyers. All right, listen, guys. You two don't need to be together anymore. You two, fine, 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 fine. Shall we fly? Yeah. Get her with her. Uh, her dad. Um, let's bring in Olivia. I've been wanting to bring her back. Alright, she's gonna bond with her dad and fly immediately over to. I forget her name. Noor. Uh, let's see. These two are bonding. These two are bonding. These two are bonding. Oh, I don't need Mary. Who's bonding with Grimoire? Nobody. Olivia has already bonded with Grimoire. Tarja in because she's the mom and I like to have things right in there. So Oh 
Fight. So tired. It's over. My life is over. Mother, I'll be by your side soon. Okay. Oops, I should have put you forward. Okay, you're gonna fly as far as you can. You are also going to fly as far as you can. And so are you. Uh, let me see what we have here. Do we have archers? She has her bow, right? She has nothing. Wonderful. Let's get the heck over there. Okay. <clears throat> well, they head off that direction. To help her. Should I bring these guys over here? I should remind myself that she actually has some skill with the sword. Oh, he's not good at trees. He's not good at trees. thing where I save to make sure I'm not doing anything stupid here. Because to lose Lissa early on definitely was stupid. So we're gonna wait there. Okay. Worse. A clean death would be mercy compared to what awaits. 
Huh? It's this, an old bell. Hmm, the string's still taut. I suppose I could use this to try and find my way out. But those bandits are too strong and scary, and... Oh, wait, my talisman. Let me just grab my talisman, and then... Huh. I am the fire and the fury. All who defy me will perish. Repent, scum. Repent, though it will save you not. Repent and despair! ha <laughs> Fly, you fools. Show her now. Oh, hello. I'll get some sparkles then. I snuck in some practice. Now, who dares face me? get there eventually. She's fine. Oh, man. I am sympathetic. Oh, he's actually close to level up. What? Fire should kill him, yes? No, it won't. It'll leave him at 2 HP. Oh, you jerk. Uh, well then. You know, you're right, Cornelia. 
I, uh, I doubted you. You hit him for as much damage as he needed to be hit for. Uh, I'm so sorry that I doubted you. Alright, so let's Bonding. Yay! Oh no. Oh, that's not good. Run, Noir! Run! my plan. Seriously, Don Q and Gaius are the best. 
I don't think I've actually protected him. Oh well. Who am I missing? Oh, these guys, right? Right. Yes, let's just randomly attack with their weakest abilities. You know, training and all that. The only way to get better is to keep doing it. Yeah! Something. It was indeed. Alright. Yes, do attack the one that's farther away. It has the attack her with a distance attack because she needs to this. <laughs> we run to each other in a field of daisies! Eh, we'll get there. She'll get there. Where's right there? We're gonna attack there. Nice. Level ups, good. Good, good, good. Finish him off. Here goes! Sweet. Right. Okay, now what? Gregor's just gonna hang out here. Attacking with fire because that works. Thank you. Way, that's right. There's no target for you over there anymore. Oh. Apparently they don't care. My daughter! I'm finally reunited with you! <laughs> Alright. Let's chill there for a while. Let's see. What can we do? What can we fight? We can fight this guy. Practice with that lance. Gotta practice. Go. Alright. We got our thief running up here. We got our other thief running up here. There's more of an assassin than a thief. Because he can't actually open things. I 
do still have that safe point, so. I wouldn't have to change it up if I didn't. No, Cordelia. Oh, my dear. My dear Cordelia. got another steel lance with her, so that's something. But I am concerned about her health right now. She's alright. And he's alright. We're fine. I can't believe she hit me. Long Q, you ought to be ashamed of yourself. Oh, hi. Finally. Uh, not any danger to the child, child. <laughs> cool. They're just gonna hang out there. Um, wow. Can I just have a moment here to... I'm gonna separate them, but before I do, I'm gonna kill these guys. Are you ready? Come on. Ooh, thanks. Because I can't heal him right away if I separate on this turn. She kills and she's not right. <sighs> okay. They are safe. They will separate. I will heal him next turn with her. In the meanwhile, we've got this guy. Do I not have... Meat for the wolf, is it?
sorry. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. Had you not saved me, I... I fear to even think what would have happened. You all right? It's all right. Take it easy. No one's going to hurt you now. Um, please, sir, let me come with you. There's someone I need to talk to, but I'm just scared to be alone. Yeah, yeah. What do you want? Um, uh, I mean, here, please look at this. What? Nice ring. It's just like mine. You messing around with alchemy? Or is this something? No, it's nothing of the sort, it's just... What? Tell me the truth, girl. You don't want to see what happens if you lie to me. What? Please, just give me... I, I need a moment. My talisman. Where's my talisman? <laughs> I am blood and thunder. I am righteous fury. I am your future daughter. What are you doing? You're trying my patience. Insolence! I speak the truth. The ring I bear also hails from the future, a memento of you, my departed mother. What? And that bizarre talisman. Huh. Your own handiwork, wrought to steal the mewling heart of your coward daughter. In its strength I did find blessed escape from grief and solitude. Fear of death and killing, too, it drove from me, until I became an avatar of retribution. Only by clinging to it have I survived the crushing desolation of a ruinated future. <laughs> Pretty much. Wait, I need that. Without it, I can't... Useless. Survive? You can and you will. And not by becoming some avatar of retribution. Just be my daughter and leave the retribution to me. Huh? Another. Interesting. Uh, this is a nasty little number. The future me is good. And very, very bad. <laughs> I can't wait. What? Mother, you're for frightening me. Again. <laughs> this little trinket will advance my research in the dark arts nicely. You have my blood, right? I'm going to need a bit of it back. <laughs> I, I mean, bleed me dry and I shall be as thunder still. <laughs> See, no daughter of mine needs a mother's prop to be strong. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is uncomfortable. <laughs> oh boy. Oh no, what have we done? Huh? <laughs> yeah, Krom, that's my thoughts exactly. Oh, this is just wonderful. <laughs> They're trading evil laughs. It's not great. It's not a great... Not a great situation we found here. <clears throat> oh, goodness me. Well, um... With that lovely note... Of... Peeling laughter... Um... <laughs> That's it for that paralogue. We've met Tharj's daughter, and now we've only a few pairs left before I feel that we have, you know, done what we're supposed to do here with these, uh, with getting the kids. Um, yeah. This is... It's going, it's actually going surprisingly well because of how hard it was to get the kids at the beginning. Clearly I just needed more battles and more bonds. So speaking of more battles and more bonds, next time, interlude time, we'll bond up Muriel and uh, Frederick. We'll battle this guy. We'll see what Noir has to say to her parents. And we'll see what other bonds we uh, happen to gain. So I'll talk to you guys then.